Hey Cancer, this is Kelly from Empire Tarot. I'm going to do your next 10 days love reading. This is for Cancer Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Please be mindful, some of the messages may or may not resonate. Take what fits, leave the rest. If you'd like to get a personal reading, there's a link in the description box below. You can book your reading there. All right, Cancer, how are you guys doing? Let's see what your love messages are. Children, your love life is being affected by children. There is separation coming. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon, but there is also engagement. Um, okay. I feel like someone might be separated from their children at this time. Um, <clears throat> or is going through a separation in their love life. Okay. Children are involved in this situation for some, but I do feel... Um, I feel like somebody here is separating from another person. Maybe they didn't want children. Um, I'm seeing engagement coming up here for you, Cancer, though. Um, let's take a look and see what the messages are here for the next 10 days for the person you might be connecting with or were if you're in separation with them. Okay, so we have the Seven of Wands. Uh, this person is definitely in defensive mode. They're thinking about something, pondering, contemplating, coming towards you, okay? Um, offering engagement, offering an opportunity for you two to be together. That They look very positive about this. This is Leo energy. Uh, some of you might be on the cusp of Cancer and Leo. Okay, there's a lot of wand energy, so you could be dealing with a fire sign. There's conflict and drama attached to this person. Um, I feel like whomever uh, your person is, it feels like this person is maybe going through a separation at this time. Um, you guys might be engaged or there might be an opportunity for that coming forward for you guys in the next 10 days. I feel like this somebody may want to um, come into a fully committed relationship with you going forward, but they have some stuff going on here in their personal life or that might be external to you that they are trying to deal with there might be competition or some family struggles um you know there's a lot of pushback on this person's end a lot of pushback it could have a lot to do with finances as well but i feel like this person is contemplating and thinking about um going into a committed relationship with you. Let's see what else is going on with this person. Okay. Justice is here. Could be Libra. We have Pisces for the hangman. Yep. Big opportunity coming in. This person wants to bring something, um, either bring you a gift. Uh, this person wants to invest justice here. I feel like this person, they may be in separation from someone else. And actually, I feel like they're coming to terms with like, it's time to make that legal, um, like to go all the way with it as far as like divorce goes. Okay. Um, they're definitely in a situation here where they're battling some legal issues, perhaps with an ex or another person. Um, let's see. Yeah, there's a lot of communication, um, maybe some arguing. I feel like this person may have to travel back and forth to deal with some past issues that's going on in their life or whomever they might be connecting with. But there's definitely some type of reconciliation at some point. There's an opening up. There's truth. I feel like this person is having a huge wake-up call. A lot of what they're dealing with with somebody else from the past is bringing them closer to you. Somebody that they are connected with is actually pushing them towards you by their their own actions that makes sense okay so right now i just feel like these next 10 days <clears throat> there maybe you separated from this person because they have a lot of drama and stuff that they need to tie up some loose ends let's take a look at the sun card let's see there could be something to do here with um uh, a children or a child or a pregnancy as well. <clears throat> Let's see the sun. Okay, yeah. So all this wand energy. Oh my gosh. Libra, Pisces, Scorpio, Leo. There's definitely a lot of pushback. I feel like um, it, it just feels like this 
person wants to fight for your connection and the more drama and chaos i feel like they're trying to keep you out of that or keep or will be trying to keep you away from that show me justice here okay so four of pentacles in the reverse okay um there's definitely there's definitely this person is trying to hold on to their money and not go bankrupt maybe from somebody else that they were connected to an ex maybe they have children with an ex um they're trying to like if there's a legal issue it's a financial legal issue that's happening at this time okay um it kind of feels like this person has a poverty mindset they're feeling vulnerable right now having to deal with someone else from the past show me this hanged man what is this like seeing things oh okay so the ace of pentacles yeah I feel like the person that you might be connecting with is just trying to end something with somebody else. Like it's been a long time. It feels like something has been over for a really long time and perhaps the other person, their ex or their other person does not really want it to end um, or is just giving them a lot of pushback in regards to this. And it just kind of feels like your person is struggling with this at this time so you guys might not be talking or they might or they're going through something you're separating yourself from it you don't want to get involved <clears throat> let's see judgment what is judgment here okay four oh i'm sorry five of cups in the reverse so i feel like your person things are going to get better cancer hope hope will return in this situation um there's an energy here of opening up, asking for forgiveness. <clears throat> As, uh, it feels like your person feels sorry about putting you through all this. I don't feel like your person is meaning to put you through all this. It's just the way things are going at this time. But I feel like this person, if there was communication or talk with them about engagement or moving something forward between the two of you, I do feel like they're going to come in and... and honor that <clears throat> honor the connection honor the relationship um, any promises that they made to you while they're going through this situation they may have been engaged to someone and they're calling it off because they've met you and they want something with you let's take a look and see what the love messages are here okay healing old wounds and childhood issues need revisiting so a lot of healing energy, trying to keep things balanced and stable, not trying to have all this extra drama. feels like your person, like I said, whoever they were connecting with, somebody's given them a lot, like giving them a hard time about these changes. Acceptance. Everything happens for a reason. So I kind of feel for you, Cancer, that right now you just need to lay low do what you have to do for yourself just understand that this this situation is happening for a reason it's happening for a purpose um, whether you decide to forgive someone that if they got you tangled up in this tangled up this tangled mess you may need to just some of you may need to just accept what's going on here is what I feel Okay, could be that you and your person were friends <clears throat> and you might be uh, like somehow maybe you got accused of having something going on with a friend who's, you know, by their ex or something. Um, but there is something here. There is a spark. There is something here with this person that's actually leading to more. Um, I feel like you may have, if this is your friend, this person is like falling for you and they want to be with you. They don't want to be with the person that they're with anymore okay support lean on your inner circle during this time some of you just really need to connect with your friends as you're going through this <clears throat> kind of feel like you're on the outside in this situation as you're going through this as you're going through this thing and i don't feel like you're really trying to be caught up in anybody else's mess but you care and you love this person some of you are willing to wait some of you are just separating and just moving on but i feel like this person's going to come in asking for forgiveness they're going to open up 
Um, they're going to tell you that they're following through with things. They want to be with you. Let's see what the moonology message is here. You are good enough. Full moon in Virgo. So if you have a moon in Virgo, that's specifically for you. But don't forget, Cancer, that no matter what you're going through, the situation, I don't feel like it really has anything to do with you per se. <clears throat> I feel like whatever's happening here, this is all this person's trying to tie up their loose ends from a past relationship. You may have met somebody who was in separation or was dealing with a lot of stuff at this time. Um, and that might have put like placed a heavy burden on your relationship. It just seems to me like things are going to, um, I almost feel like somebody saying to you, just please hold on, don't leave me. Just hold on, I'm, I'm working through this stuff now. This person wants to marry you. They want to, you know, be in a full committed relationship with you. Okay. Okay. Learning a new skill. Some of you mature, dynamic, fiery male. I feel like some of you are definitely dealing with a fire sign. You know, you don't have to be. Or they're coming across with very passionate, strong, fiery energy. Okay. Um, I feel like this person's learning <laughs> some pretty huge lessons. Okay, new passionate start. See, it's got fire written all over it. <clears throat> this person wants to really have this new beginning with you, truly. So the next 10 days, be patient. You may need to be patient. Let's take a look and see what your charms are. Okay. All right. So we have some tools here. So your person might work with tools, hammers, nails, wrenches, what have you. They might be a mechanic or, or a carpenter. They have, uh, but there's learning new skills as well. So somebody here might be beginning a new job or maybe they finished school and they're going into a, a new job. They're trying to get their finances together to pay for something. Um, you might be working with tools right now. I also have like a, a mirror. Okay, maybe you're looking in the mirror, putting on your makeup or brushing your teeth, listening to this or just getting yourself ready for the day or the evening. For some of you, there is a child here. So there is a child who's very significant. It looks like a little girl. It seems to be a very significant uh, influence on this relationship, a little girl. Okay, yep, some of you are just focusing on your beauty routine at this time, all right? You just, or, you know, your, whatever you guys do, getting your hygiene up, really focusing. Um, I, I just feel like you've been through a lot, Cancer, through this connection here. Um, there might have been like a third party thing, but it feels like the third party thing is coming to an end and this person is just trying to, you know, like I said, tie up loose ends. And then we have like a little flower here. It feels like a sunflower. And I keep feeling that sun energy. So it, it just makes me feel like things are going to get better. It also feels like um, uh, a mum. Maybe it's mummy or someone like calls their mother mummy. Okay. And also um, like a mum, like a flower, like fall flowers. You might be working with mums. What are they called? <clears throat> can't remember the actual name. I just keep seeing mums, you know, like fall flowers. Maybe you're planting some, you're listening to this, or you're thinking about putting mums around your house. What the heck are they called? Mums. <laughs> I can't remember. But anyway, that's going to be your reading. Um, I know it's short and sweet, but for the next 10 days, so just keep your eyes peeled. Um, and if you want to get personal reading, link is below this video. Please hit like, share, and subscribe. Um, and I will see you guys in 10 days. All right, take care.